Charlie Volt here, and we are playing Call of Duty Ghost. The new expansion Onslaught, and we are playing on the map Containment. Now these maps are brand new to me, I have not seen them, nor have I played on them at all. Um, I don't know the layouts other than this map that's given to us right here. We're playing a kill confirmed map mode of uh, team deathmatch, which is something I haven't really played in the past, but I did play a couple rounds of it prior to this, and uh, Time to work, it's actually fly. pretty fun. So you can actually deny the enemy points to win a match. Look at this, how nice this looks. I think Call of Duty really stepped it up for these maps. That guy. I don't know if he was lagging or just walking. He was slowed maybe from a flash. I bet that's what it was because it was he was barely moving. there myself. Kill confirmed. Kill denied. Enemy satcom spotted. Can we go to the left? Oh come on, really in the head? I don't kill him and I shoot for the head. And I hit him because it lit up red. times I've actually wished that I had the grenade in here instead of the oh the ceiling pretty sneaky there I actually didn't see that Kill confirmed. what I'm trying to do is get used to uh, not sighting in for close range not really something I'm accustomed to very much because it always seems like I should want to side in. I mean, it's just sort of natural. But it takes up time and before you can even get your weapon sighted. Sometimes you end up dying. Ouch. 
Oh, she just got it in the back, too. <laughs> Only in Call of Duty Ghosts is a pistol more deadly than a freaking assault rifle, or rather a semi-automatic version of that. someone jumping down and get me from behind so I stopped moving there. There's a perk that's called Amplify. I have it as well and you can you can hear uh, footsteps. throwing down the bag. And my dog's just standing there. What's up, Fido? I hope he lived. Wow. Well, I didn't hear a guard dog killed, but I also don't see him running to me, so... Someone coming. See that, honestly? I would have been dead there. Now he got me another kill. See that? Nice to have. Nice to have. That freaking pistol. Tell you what, it's not a bad idea. Denied my kill, huh? You get me, you gotta get Fido too. Alright. Ooh, got across the way there. Sniping out down there. I don't know if you saw that or not. If you look in the video, he's he was down by the trees, across the path there, kind of like where that guy just ran. Only problem is, is how the hell am I going to get across there? Uh-oh. My dog. My dog. Wow, I'm getting some lag. The bad thing about Call of Duty is that they do matchmaking, so they uh, match you up with players, and the pings don't necessarily always have to be close. So I guess you can modify some of your files and make them uh, and and limit. What the ping is of the servers you actually connect to, but 
Alright, let's find out here. Oh, they didn't jump down like I anticipated. Alright, so this is across the way at the church. That's where this other guy was over here. Time's almost up. Actually, pretty good to know. I didn't know where they were earlier when I looked back across here. I thought the church was actually down a little farther to my right. We've lost the lead. But as I was saying, the Call of Duty Ghosts, even though they're supposed to have dedicated servers, it's they select where to put you. You don't get the option of looking for a server with a good ping and only playing on that one. You're automatically put into a server yeah, and you have no is. idea. And in this case, I'm getting some lag that I really shouldn't be. Overall, that was a pretty good round. Thanks to Fido. And until next time.